done. Body checking is the final step in the four-step checking progression. Now, a body check is defined as body contact primarily caused by the movement of the checker. This movement is usually in a different direction from that of the puck carrier. The checker uses his or her body to stop the attacking progress of the puck carrier and or separate the carrier from the puck. Now, you can see why the first three steps of the progression, which teach strong, controlled skating, plus good balance and approach angling, are so important in learning how to body check. Okay guys, the next drill we're going to do here is body contact and body checking and we're going to use the boards. We want you to imagine that you're playing against another player, but we're just going to use the boards as what we want to practice with. What you're going to do is get nice and low, get your leg low, and you're going to explode into the board and pin the player there. So your leg's extending here to give you some force, and this one's nice and bent. So right here, you're looking up, and you're moving right into the boards. I'd like you guys to try it spreading out along here, and then we'll start moving up the boards doing it. Let's see you spread out. Get down nice and low. Explode into the boards. Good job. OK, start going here, big guy. Nice, good pin. There we go. Go ahead. Good job, Ryan. boy, Chris. Get that leg nice and low. Good. OK, there, Reed. Good. Give him a good pop, Reed. Good. You guys did a real nice job with that. That's the way to get nice and low. That's the way to explode into there. That's the way to keep the guy pinned. Good job. OK, guys, this time in this hitting drill, in this body contact drill, what you're going to do is you're going to take your partner out and you're going to hit him against the boards and hold him there for a second. So what we want you to do is get nice and low again and explode into your teammate here. Push with your outside leg, your inside leg's nice and bent, and I'm going to move right into Corey and I'm going to hold him there for a second. Okay, now this leg's got all the weight on it. It's pushing right in. Okay, and now if I'm Corey, Corey's not going to let me hit him. He wants to push back. He wants to push back, and that's how he protects himself. So now, if we're doing it, Corey's going to push out, and I'm going to push in, and hopefully uh, I'll be able to hold him for a second. And then now uh, we're in good position. I'd like you guys to try it. Let's have the white guys, the guys in the white jerseys, hitting the guys in the dark jerseys. OK, get down and do it right stationary, nice and low, and hold him in there. Good, a couple more. OK, this time do it in motion. 